Adventures. This is Boonie Camp, and we are off to another Boondoggling Adventure! Super excited to be playing yet another game of Ultimate General Civil War, uh, because this next fight is going to be Fredericksburg. If you're just getting into the, uh, the action and just watching my videos, this is uh, just a, you know, YouTube channel where I sometimes record myself playing games or stream myself playing games and just have fun with it you know I just uh, that's the whole point of all these video games is just having fun with it I'm not really looking for any hardcore craziness uh, to relax to relax but if uh, you remember from the last video we went ahead and we ooh, dang I had a bunch of guys wounded in that last battle even Brewster, I didn't even realize that. Uh, but we went ahead and re-upped all of our troops, uh, made sure that they were good uh, in preparation for the Battle of Fredericksburg right here, okay? So let's go ahead and read through the correspondences that we have, and uh, then we'll pick up on the Fredericksburg Grand Battle. Captured message. So we're going to do this in the southern accent now. In obedience to my received orders, we have battled the enemy in Ayuka and lost almost all of our artillery and supplies. I have already sent my battle report to headquarters, but please make sure your general will receive my request for more troops. If I do not have support quickly, I will have no chance to hold against Boonicap. Second capture message. The army of General Boonicap presents a large threat for the Confederate cause. President Jefferson Davis has approved reinforcements of 2,500 crack troops to assist your efforts. Finally, this is a report from my Union leadership. After the Battle of Ayuk, Confederates begun receiving extra recruits, estimated a total strength of 3,500 green soldiers. Now, with this game, something you watch uh, while you're playing, the, pre the battles that lead up to the main battle, uh, they they give you bonuses to the main battle. So I've won three battles leading up to the main battle, uh, the, and I've won the Battle of Antita. So this really helps me out. The enemy's going to have minus five percent. Let me get it on there. Minus five percent army size uh, from the Battle of Antita, and then the enemy's going to have minus ten percent enemy army experience. So they're going to be less veterancy. And come on now. And the enemy's going to have, again, minus 5% army size. So there's going to be 10% army size that the enemy's minus at Fredericksburg. So that's going to be good for us. Let's go ahead and read this Fredericksburg Grand Battle, and then we will start the battle. All right. 11 December 1862. We are pressed by the government to cross the rapid hot... Ooh, that's a, that's a nasty one. Reading is important. Guys. <laughs> we are pressed by the government to cross the... Rappahannock River and advance to Richmond. The town of Fredericksburg offered a suitable ground to prepare for and prepare for the crossing because of the nearby railroad that connects with our supply chain. Bureaucratic procedures delayed the arrival of the necessary pontoon bridges, giving Lee precious time to reinforce the area. While our engineers try to build the bridges, they are continuously harassed by Confederate sharpshooters, delaying ifs even more. After many days, on December 11, 1862, our army is finally able to cross the Rappahannock. On the other side, the whole Confederate army of Northern Virginia awaits entrenched, occupied, occupying the heights, the heights of southern of the south town, south of the town. There we go. Kind of fell apart of the last part, but that's okay. I don't read for a living. Maybe I do. That's alright. This victory is going to really help us out. So we want to try to get... Always want to try to get the full victory. Okay? Uh, let's go ahead and get into the, uh, the layout mode. Now, if you saw me setting up my, my troops, what I did was I made my... Uh, I made my, my I didn't have, didn't have enough to be able to fill out full brigade. So what I did was I made my main first corps, my primary brigade, they're full, almost completely full. Um, 
uh, but they're full of crack troops. So that way I could be, you know, be ready uh, for the attack. My when I plan on doing is use my my main uh, first core to hammer the enemy, while my second core comes in and. Uh, and my third corps comes in with their less brigades, just hold the enemy in place while first corps does all the hard work, okay? So that's what the plan is. We'll see how it works. Uh, maybe it will, maybe it won't. Go ahead and start. The army of the Potomac. Uh, the army of the Potomac is preparing to cross the Rappahannock River at Fredericksburg. The Confederates have destroyed all the bridges, but our engineers are currently constructing pontoon bridges. Okay. Hmm, pontoon bridges. Doesn't sound very safe. The rebels are delaying our engineers with their snipers, but our men are progressing and will soon complete two bridges at this section. Okay? A few hundred meters away, we're constructing another bridge. Alright. Three bridges are being built to the east to allow control of the southern part of the town. Alright. We will execute the main attack from this side, advance and destroy the rebel right flank. That's where I've got my first core. Uh, Prospect Hill is heavily defended by the Confederates, but if we secure it, we will ensure a decisive victory. This hill overlooks the rail line supplying the Confederate army and offers a fast mean of transport to Richmond. Okay. Remember, we're trying to get Richmond. That's the Confederate capital. Let's go and crush them. Okay. The center of the Confederate forces are located on this hill, securing Telegraph Road. The ground is heavily fortified and harsh. Attack here is not advised. Okay, so only attack there if we have crushed them everywhere else. Mary Heights controls the Confederate left flank and is heavily has heavily entrenched positions. We should attack Mary Heights to distract the forces while we overwhelm the right flank. Well, that was the plan to begin with. Oh, that makes sense. Doing good. Confederate snipers harassing the our engineers who are trying to finish the construction of the pontoon bridges. Force Confederates to withdraw from the town so the engineers can complete the bridges and our whole army can start crossing the river tomorrow. Okay. Clellan. Kemper. Canfield. I don't know. This is going to be... I don't know what they have. They have. I'm getting three brigades in this. Ooh, should I take... What are these guys? No. Do I have any more filled out brigades in this? I think I do. Uh, Stantham has 2,500. Yeah. We want these big ones to be the ones to take those hits. Because, uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's going to be nasty trying to charge across two pontoon bridges. McClellan, you're going to do. Go ahead and back them up. Okay, guys. Let's hop in there and do this. Start battle. Got to get across the bridge. Got to get across the bridge. Just move up forward a little bit. Clellan, you're going to be there. You're going to be there. You got to get across. That's why I've got these 2,500 guys. And I think they have two general. They have a general with them and a general with them. So that's where it's going to help out. Get across. Get across. Clellan, get up, give them as much leadership as you can as they get across the bridge. Bridges, okay? And Canfield, I'm gonna need you up next to the clown. You guys need to line there, okay? Yeah. Uh, start opening some cannon fire on those guys. Now I want you cross the bridges before you really start getting. Come on, guys, you can do it. Get across those bridges. Woo hoo! A lot of boys. Come on, get across. Get across. Come on, get across. Make a line. Move your 
line just a little bit there. Okay. Target park sells for us. Fallen. Move up. Canefield move up. I'm gonna let him trade some shots for a minute. Whittle them down. Come on, keep, keep open fire. That's it, that's it. Now we just gotta hold the line for a little while. Okay, boys? Hold the line for a little while. Pass. Move up on the skirmishers. I actually want you to camp. I don't want people to hit you on your plane. What I want to try to do is push them out of the town, little bit by little bit. Okay. Try to corral them out of the town. Nope. Come on. Secured Fredericksburg, okay. Alright guys, we did it. We did that first battle, we secured Fredericksburg. Getting our boys across the river. Okay. Next, the remaining Confederates that were defending the town have withdrawn to the heights. On December 12th, a large part of your army crossed the other side to secure the riverbank. Today we can begin our attack. Get a little water. Uh, yeah, hear the... the of sipping noises. Mm. Okay, let's go ahead and well, uh, let's see. Do we have? Let's go to the camp real quick. Is there anything I can do in the camp? Anything I can do in the camp? Well, I got no money, so. But I might be able to come in here. Nope. Nope. Nothing. Nothing. I got no money to be able to do anything with. So, well, it's all right. Back. Oh no no no! That's the wrong button. <laughs> <laughs> That's the wrong button too. Doing a lot of wrong buttons there. Okay, uh, we're gonna go ahead and continue. There we go. Fix that one there. Okay. Start the battle. 
Today, we are ready to advance. <clears throat> Let's see it. Let's get that advance on. You should concentrate your forces to attack Prospect Hill. Watch out for Rebel Cavalry, masking their right side. Watch out for the Rebel Cavalry. All right, this is first core. No, the yeah, this is first core. First core and first core. Um, we are gonna push. Looks like okay. See how the line is? They've got fortified defensive positions there. Fortified positions there, and then and these positions go. There's the rail line there. And there's the flag there. Now, I might be able to skirt the whole defensive line that they have got going on over there and then just hit down here. This is really where I will need to do it. And that way I can just avoid all this mess because you know they're going to have a mess right there. And it's going to be a pain about trying to fight into those woods. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to set up our guys so that everybody can Let's go straight down to that corner and then we can push it and we don't have to fight through that mess what do you guys think I think that's a good plan uh, we will see looks like that would be what uh, the, the good option the, the good idea to do let's get them all the way up oh no ah uh, how did I do that I don't know I don't know how to ah that was a bad accident. Drop him back there. There we go. We got to straighten out. All right. Nah, that's how I did it. You got to click and you hold. Didn't realize that. I've been playing this game for a couple weeks now, and I still am learning new things. Okay. So there. Uh, I want my guys to come on. Maybe I can. Can I? Can I click these guys off there and bring them over here? No, we can't. Okay, so that's we're just gonna move them up, move them up, move them up. I'm gonna give them this line here, a three-man line in front, two-man line in the back, skirmishers on the flank, Cav on the flank, Haskell with the goodies right there. General's gonna be right there. So the player's gonna follow up behind him. All right. Uh. Got a lot of cannon. A lot of, lot of cannon, boys. Right there. I'm gonna go ahead and put all these cannon back here. Because again, we're gonna try to line everybody up down south and just hit them. Hit them hard. Alright? We're gonna try to do that. So, Carol, Rhodes, do ye. Okay, that's what we're gonna try to do. Let's go ahead and pick them up. Line them up down south here. Let's pick these guys up. And line them up down south here. I think this this will be a good preparation. Good setup for uh, an attack into them down here. Okay? Because again it does the, the our objective is this flag. So why go through this gigantic, what's, what we know is going to be a gigantic mess. Guys here, trying to fight through the woods. No, there's no point. We want to get the objective first. Okay. Oh, I forgot that I even had these guys up here. I should have moved them too. Alright, we'll move them up here. Get them across the field. They're dropping some fire on us, but that's alright. Carol, do ye... What are you doing up here, Rhodes? Were you not part of the group I grabbed? Carol, do ye... We're gonna go into the woods here, get some observations. Oh, there's a cannon down there. They got cannon everywhere. Go over here, do ye. Go over here. They're cannoning right into us, huh? This is what we want to do, though. Because I am not... I, I am not going to lose massive amounts of troops. 
trying to uh, charge into that. There we go. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to flank them in these woods here. Get over here, Rhodes. I'm going to get all my skirmishers into these woods. And they're going to start laying down fire on these calves. Look at these calves in the woods here. They're trying to be sneaky. They're trying to be sneaky. Look at him trying to be sneaky. <laughs> no, not sneaky on me. You're not sneaking up on me. What we're going to do is we're going to ride all our cav in the woods here. We're going to have a big cav battle supported by skirmishers. What do y'all think about that? You think that'll be fun? Come on. Get online, Trig. Get online, Trig. We're going to get you up into this fight here. I want you guys up. Oh, there we are. There they are. That's it. I want you to get with those cannons right there. Okay? Get online, Rose. We're gonna cut these calves off. Their main force. Okay? Oh no, they're moving too fast. guys get on a line here. We're gonna start sweeping them along the field that way. Okay. Get them there. Okay, do we do not want cab charging up behind me at the very very least. I don't want cab charging up behind me. So that's that's a no. And look at all these guns on the line. Lay these guns out right. Yeah. All right. It looks like we're gonna have to do some placements, personal placements right there. Okay. Board. You're there. All right. Sweeping them out of the woods. Sweep in other woods. Sweep, 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 sweep. McNair, sweep behind, sweep behind, sweep behind. Come on, you two. Sweep behind. Get there. Push down, push down, push down, push, push down. Custer, you hang out, Custer. You always get your help and stuff, Custer. So we're just gonna put you there. Mass this artillery all together in one group. And Lewis, get behind these guys. Booney Cap, main fighting's going over here, so I want to be the main line. Okay? Move them up. We're gonna move them up. We're gonna push them out of the woods. Little by little, we're gonna push them out of the woods. Skirmishers across. Skirmishers across. We got two minutes and thirty seconds. It's enough time. Doing good. Get that cab there. Get that cab there. New cab. New cab. Guinness. Fall in with them. All right. They're still. Fire Brigade, fall in, fall in, fall in, fall in. Custer, stay with the artillery. <laughs> uh, Aspen, over here. Claire, get online. You guys take your time. It's alright. Skirmisher, get over here. Tolbert, get over here. We're just sweeping them along. Sweeping them along, sweeping them along. Come on, we're doing good. We're almost on that line right there. Okay. Okay. 
Kelly, I want you to come over here and back these guys up. That's what we're gonna do. Back them up. 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 Four. Back them up. Behind. That's what we're doing, guys. Okay. Now, I could have sworn I told four of my screamers to put these over there. Okay. It's alright. Screamers to the south. Get over here. Get over here. Sweet. Sweet. Okay, you guys are getting flanked. Turn. Turn. No. Turn. Forces. Please throw away. There we go. This is not gorgeous. We got two minutes left. We are almost on the point. This is absolutely gorgeous. Can this get in here? Okay. Come 
behind there. Almost on the point. Get over here, rallies. See what we're going to behind them. Baker, get on that line. Get up over here. Get up over here. Oh. All right, we are hammering them hard. Swimming lane. <laughs> I will say it does look like there's something to run 
seriously low on some, uh, on some supplies. Alright, very quick, push up a little bit more. Over, push up a little bit. Push up, push up, push up. Lewis, come down here, it's in line. Whiting, come down here, it's in line. Guys, keep pinching it up. Keep pinching it up. Taking the heights. Meanwhile, attack at Merrill Heights is commencing. Okay, this is where it's gonna be nasty because I know we do not have a full, full, full uh the, the full core that they want us to have. So it's all right. It's all right. Move them up. 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 In fact, we only have one unit of cannon. Move them up. Move them up. Clellan, you're going to need to definitely be in the center of all this. Oh my goodness gracious, look at this. Look at this line. This is just a nasty charge out, out in the open. Get forward, get forward. What we're gonna do, we're gonna move these guys over here. We're going to attack this main line. We're all gonna go for Kershaw in the center. So you guys need to get up there so you can search off the fire. I don't know if I'm gonna make this. I got three minutes to be able to push in, push these guys out of the way. Get up. Perk, move up a little bit. Hayes, move up a little bit. Richards, move up. I want you guys move up. Move up. Move up. Open fire on that line, guys. Get over here. Frank, move up. Okay, so we have a bunch of guys on this line here. Keep pushing forward. Keep pushing forward. In charge. Gosh darn. That did not work at all. 
Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We have number three to one at that point. But I don't think it's going to happen, guys. That's what we're going to do. We're going to readjust and we're come down south. We'll try this at the foot. I don't think we're going to take this point, these heights. Come on. So we got three minutes. We can get back online. Try to push the coke. I think by doing that we will have less guys targeting us. We might be able to sweep them. It's just gonna be it's gonna be an interesting interesting push. I'll tell you guys what. I just don't see it. It's gonna be difficult. I just don't think we had enough of our, our crack troops ready for this. Brown, start moving in there, start pushing across while you guys get there, get there, get there. Frank, get there. Stratham, get there. Clellan, move up. Brown, move over. Okay. Cannon, let's camp. Oh, where's my cannon at? Force, force, fire on them. Far, Lily. I want you to be in here.
this is not I'm really yeah I know I'm not talking much guys but I'm really focused on trying to get this done get up here place the fire on this game There we go. Finally broken. They fire on those guys. That's all right.
Where are you guys going down here? You guys definitely go for a trip down there, Tolbert. Try to extend this line just a little bit. Okay. Let's see if we can. You guys have got this. I know I'm getting. I'm not talking as much, guys, but. Whew. I'm trying my hardest to get this point. I have a minute left, less than a minute. minute left and these guys are exhausted. Oh, nope, never mind, I changed my mind. Come on. Got 38 seconds to get on that point. I don't know. trouble it happen. 
happening, guys. Dang, I didn't even realize he was all the way back there. Okay, though, uh, so far this is a victory. If, I mean, I've still got heavy power south, uh, so I think, I think overall this is going to got eight seconds left. Five seconds left. You don't want to spend the last five seconds of the game running away, do you? Come on, Haas. You guys fought hard. Oh man, I just that thing. Said no siree. Yeah, I think it's that's it. It's two seconds left. They are. My line is breaking. They pushed hard, but uh, didn't do it well. It wasn't enough. Wasn't enough. Continue attacking or withdraw. Uh, I'm gonna withdraw. General Army's already paid heavy toll for attacking those hills, but we can still claim victory. Mary's Heights could be captured if only we attack decisively. What troops do I have to do it? Telegraph most probably we, we might be weakened if the rebels reinforce their flanks. Prospect Hill is the objective already decided. Okay, I gotta get prospect kill. Oh, what? No way. I've got nothing left. Oh, man. I've got absolutely nothing left. Might be able to sneaky sneak. Still capture Telegraph Road. But uh Yeah, 
Yeah. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna wait until I get like 10 seconds left. Then I'm gonna charge those guys up. Four seconds left. Twenty-eight seconds left. Twenty-four, twenty-three. Oof. Yeah, that was a hard fight, guys. I know I got really quiet on that one, but it was. And I'm trying to really think of how I need to move these guys and try to play complete detention. Oof, I start getting quiet because it starts getting tough. Oh, getting shot at again. It's all right, and I'm pretty good with getting charged for it. Charge forward, take the point. Take the supplies. Woods. There you go. All right. Uh, I, I don't have no idea. If they don't give me first core and the rest of those guys down south, I, um, yeah, that's how it's going to be. Uh, yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah, thank you for giving me this one. This, uh, this was not going to be a victory at all. I don't know what to do with that. Honestly. Okay, so I've got the South Hill. I've got two main points, it looks like. I'm controlling them. Now. Okay.
it looks like a general is loose on his own. Is that the case? I think I'm gonna have a big cab battle over here in a second. That's what it looks like I'm gonna have. Big old cab battle. Push forward, push forward, push forward, push forward. Where are you guys going? Push forward, push forward. Kelly, where are you guys going? forward. I had a victory. Okay. I had a victory. I held the point. I held both points because I kind of sneaked, snuck a troop back there when they weren't looking. So that worked. Uh, but I'm telling you, the casualties were bad. I had almost half. I actually, there was only a quarter. Almost a quarter. It was, it was a little, it was, it was a bad. A lot, a lot, lost a lot of infantry. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, Let's see, we had had some ten, only 10 guns lost. That is really good. That is really good, because I do li I like losing my guns. Um, calf, that is probably the best calf casualty rate I have ever had so far in this game. I was very conservative with my calf. Uh, and they had some heavy calf losses, although they definitely, they didn't lose it. We didn't really push the calf into a big calf battle. We were kind of using them just threaten more than anything. I lost 32 guns. Uh, yeah, it was, it was overall. It was actually a pretty good victory for the low number of lo losses that we had. Uh, overall, it was a, a, a victory. We had, did, yeah, overall it was a victory. Okay, I will take it. I will take that victory. We'll roll with it. Okay. Let's look about leveling up these troops a bit, okay? We've got 10,000 more troops. Let's look about getting these cores filled in. Iron Brigade lost as general. Brewster's going to hop in there to take, take a hold for it. Okay. That's what we're going to do right now is we're going to look at getting yes, sir. some of these brigades and cores filled out the way they should really be. We're going to do cheap guns, we're going to go mass numbers, and that's where we're going to go at. How many points do I got? Uh, Springville 1861. Rosencrenz is here. Well, let's before we do that, you spend those points. Let's go ahead and... Wow. The first time ever. First core Left leaves a battle without having lost yes, sir. the entirety of you know an entire brigade. Nice, nice. I'm I'm really actually really happy with that. Okay. Go ahead and Sinclair is going to work on their gunnery. Work on discipline, stamina, work on logistics, work on logistics, work on logistics. Okay. Gonna work on some, uh, gonna work on some strength. Level them all the way. Get them, get them fully up, fully up. Right now, we're gonna work on numbers right now. This. This rotation is going to be all about yes, numbers. Sir. Don't have enough Springfield 61s. Get them up there. Get them fully leveled out. There we go. That's good. 
almost got them to 500. That's really nice. No. Yes, sir. Uh, come on, Dory. Level them up there. Clear. All right, Barnes. Okay, Meredith, does he have, oh yeah, get him all the way leveled up too. Yes, sir. Uh, Brewster. Okay, are they all leveled up, leveled up, everybody? Leveled up, leveled up, leveled up, leveled up, leveled up. Leveled up, everybody's leveled up, okay. Up there, get him up there. Sir, yes, sir. Get him up there. Get him up there. Okay. Daniel's gonna go ahead and there. I know I always say, that, hey, well, we're just gonna focus on trying to get them fleshed out and then I end up getting the best things and the best guns but this time we're really gonna try to focus on trying to get as many troops as we can and new brigades and any support build out as much as possible these next time can worry less about veterans sir, yes, sir. about and it looks like what's gonna hurt us first is the money bank so we're gonna go ahead and money bank <laughs> all right all right and so what do we got we got a rolly three troops there so go ahead and create uh, Stokes we're gonna bring you down here you and these out a little bit oh no bring them there bring them there there we go that's better troops troops come over here and look at these four oof, 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 oof. this guy's got hurt really bad Okay. What do we have left in the guns department? We have 305, but I don't get none in the shop. $20 for those. $10 for the. Remember, we're gonna go and equip. We're just gonna go full troops. Oh, darn it. We can only get 2,300 of those. We're running low on guns, guys. We are running low on guns. Look at these. Cannon. What do we got on cannon? We got any in the. Got just one or two. Okay. What do we have for cav? Collect barely anything. Okay. What do we have for skirmishers? Barely anything. We'll go ahead and give these guys some cannon. Uh, those are 10 pounds. Great. We've got two cannon, two cannon. Mm. Mm -hmm. We we'll focus on that first. Uh maybe a little calf? 
Maybe a little cav. Maybe a little skirmish. Maybe a little skirmish. Maybe a little infantry. All right. Career. Let's get some po politics going on. What does the logistics do? Additional ammo. No, we'll get the pol. Uh. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll go ahead and move what we just did. And army. I've got four reputation points to spend. Alright. Let's look at this battle. Uh, correspondence. We'll go ahead and read the correspondence. Well, now I'll skip reading the correspondence to save for the next video because we're not going to do. We're going to go ahead and pause that. So we have two battles. We've got Parker's Crossroads. We got Stones Rivers. Parker's Crossroads and Stones Rivers, okay? Stones River. Okay. So, let's go ahead and take a look before we get done. What is Stones Rivers gonna entail us having to do? 2020. 2020. Mm, we might be able to get them filled out somewhat. I don't think we're gonna get 2020 20, but we might be able to get them filled out, filled out pretty decently. Uh, we got one more thing going on, can't. Alright. Whew, well, that was definitely a tougher battle. Uh, it was a victory. We've had better victories. We've also had worse victories. But, uh, I will take it. I, I will take it. Okay. So. Dogglers. Battles. And just, you know people watch. I'm glad you were able to join me on this uh, latest adventure. And I'll see you in the next one.